Here we go with the Tabata workout. We're gonna do two different Tabata sets. Each one is eight small 20 second sets with 10 seconds in between. So each one is four minutes. The short and intense could add another extra set repeat one of these again if you want but ideally we're going to work at a high enough intensity we're going to do a short efficient workout with your rest with your warm-up of around 15 to 18 minutes altogether so first about a set two movements we're going to start with quarter turn squats so facing the front little down pop round pop round and then we're coming to the other side so we're quarter turning on three sides then we're going to go to a plank position and two options toe tap just out to the side or plank jacks both feet in and out and you can change those variations as we go through the little sets so you're able to keep going keep moving at a good intensity so eight sets all together four times through these two movements 20 seconds there quarter turn squats Good squat down, little pop round. Land it, hit again. Nice. Taking it down then. Remember, two options. With a plank toe tap or plank jacks. Here we go. So, toe tap out to the side, keeping the hips down. Want to increase the intensity? In and out, plank jacks. Very soft. Cycling through then, between the two movements. Great job, keeping it going. Plank jacks in and out. Remember, you can scale it down to the toe tap. We want to keep going, we do want to make it intense at a time. Each movement is just 20 seconds. So we're powering through. Back in, keep it going. Great job, keeping this going, keeping it moving. Last pair on this first set. Great job. Then we'll go again. Remember, plank jack or toe taps. Here we go. Great 
Okay, second set. Two more movements, two more exercises. Increasing the intensity just a little bit more, which means we're gonna actually simplify things a little tiny bit, but keep it working. So, first off, we're gonna squat into a little jump. It's gonna get pretty intense, pretty quick. Quads are already working hard. We're gonna work even harder now. If we need to, drop this down into an air squat. No jump, just keep moving. Then, we're gonna take it down, plank position for this time. Mountain climbers, wanna push the tempo, cardiovascular system working hard, and getting the core and the whole body, with upper body supporting, working hard as well. Push intensity up for the second to batter set. So, keeping good form, keeping a simple movement, and keeping it going now. Squats first, jump, to make it more intense, here we go. Powering through. I actually like to count the reps. Try and do 20, one per second. That's already there, nice and intense. Lactic acid build up, lactic acid recovery. Here we go. Oh. First pair done. Go through again. Three more times. We're going to keep working, keep pushing. Back into the squats, just a little jump, just makes it a bit more intense, more muscular, motor units firing. And again, high position, and I sweat on. Good fast tempo on these mountain climbers. If you can, you need to keep the hips down as well. My legs aren't very long, it's easy to do. Just don't bring your knees up too far. Great job. Halfway. Keep it going. Here we go. Still working. Three twenty seconds to go. Last pair. Keep squatting, if you're not jumping, keep the squat pattern going, keeping it moving. Right. Last set of mountain climbers, making eight little sets. Here we go. There we go then, two sets off to batter done. At the very most, you might want to repeat one set, but should be aiming for a high enough intensity in those two sets. They feel they've done a great short workout there. 
Another thing you can use these to bat for is cardio after a different sort of workout, after your waist workout. Four minutes, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off, particularly that second one, jump squats, mountain climbers, going to be really, really efficient way of putting some intervals, some intense cardio after your main workout.